G'day, what's up? My name is Daniel O'Grady and welcome to another Wasabi Cars video. Thank you all very much for joining me and I've learned from my previous mistakes. I've plugged in the mic, so good on me. Now, uh, once again, we're diving in, we, I'm diving into the Nagoya archives. So when I was there in December, I visited the Mitsubishi Auto Gallery uh, and also nearby was Rocky Auto and then I went on to the Toyota Automobile Museum. Now, this Toyota Corolla was at Rocky Auto. Now, of course, Rocky Auto, he is known, uh, Yoshia Watanabe, is known for his, his Nissans. Now, this magazine features a couple of his creations. There's uh, that camera. Ah, that's the one from the poster, of course. Uh, that was given to me by Mr. Watanabe himself. And then he's got this brown fair lady here with the V8 in it. So yeah, he specializes in, specializes in Nissans, if you don't already know. Um, so this was a real surprise. And um, I did a video of me walking through his sort of junkyard area, spare parts area. Um, yeah, it's fair ladies, it's skylines. And that's about it. So the fact that he's got a Toyota Corolla in there and for sale, well, I'm assuming it's for sale. It, it's an odd thing. And um, I did check the website and he does have other cars for sale. Jaguars, Mitsubishi, Subarus, all sorts of cars. But um, anyway, just a surprise to see this one. Interesting color. I sort of like it actually, that sort of green. Very, very nice. Now looking at this grill, I did see that grill before on a 11. And uh, I was scratching my head wondering what year it might be. Oh, it's not 11, of course, it's a four door. Um, it could be the 1.2 liter KE20 or the 1.4 liter TE20. I'm just not sure. Ah, and that's why I went to his website to look for some details. Couldn't find any. But uh, yeah, it appears to be a late 71 or 72 Toyota Corolla High Deluxe. That's what the badge on the uh, boot lid says, a High Deluxe. Um, now, unfortunately, when I went to Rocky Auto, though he was there and he treated me very, very kindly, he didn't, you know, he can't really give everyone a tour and pop hoods and open doors. And so I have to settle with outside pictures, just can't be helped. But uh, what an interesting little, you know, grocery getter in great condition. So great to see. Now, as you're watching this video, I wonder if you are not seeing some absolute hot looking Nissans in the background. And I will be doing further videos from Rocky Auto. Absolutely. Yep, that's a nice little Toyota, that one. Yep. Okay, guys, just a short video. And uh, keep an eye out for the Wasabi Cars website. That is coming along very nicely. It, it will feature some, uh, how can I say, like Rocky Auto videos. And there's going to be a map. If it's not already up, uh, it won't be, but it will be. <laughs> So do check that out. And question of the day is um, inspired by this car. It's a Toyota in Rocky Auto. That's like, um, and not an, an ugly duckling. Yeah, it's, a, it's like the odd one out. So tell me something that you saw recently that was just the odd one out. It was different to all the other ones, okay? Thank you very much, everyone, and take it easy. Goodbye. With a little bit of rust and a little bit of dirt, I was having cows and I never heard of was having.